there are no skid marks leading from the town pier parking lot down to the boat ramp. The blue Audi S4 plunged into the water. The doors were locked and uh, the vehicle was submerged. You couldn't even see the vehicle. You, even with a mask on underwater, you couldn't see it. The car in deep, the water murky. Police and firefighters struggling to reach the driver. Tim Davis is an Afghan war vet. At the pier walking his dog, army training kicked in. He didn't think twice. No, no, no time for fear. Just do what needs to be done and worry about it after. Grabbing a tow cable and diving into the frigid water. Couldn't see underwater. He couldn't do anything. Um, we tried to tried to get him. Um, couldn't get the windows. The blue Audi S4 sustaining heavy damage as it rolled over underwater several times while it was being towed out. Eventually uh, we were able to break the windows and uh, get a, a cable around the car and, and pull the car up far enough we were able to uh, open the door and extract a male victim who was later pronounced dead. A sad ending despite a courageous effort. The driver, 42 years old from Kingston, was pronounced dead at South Shore Hospital. Uh, just what can we do? You know, everything we tried to do, it just wasn't wasn't working for us that time. Now, there are several security cameras here at the town pier. Police say the video shows the car plunging into the water, but not what happened in the moments before, if it was parked here or when the driver got in. The state police and the Plymouth EA are now heading up this investigation.